था हाँ वन डे रिया वेंट विथ हर मदर टू द इलेक्ट्रॉनिक स्टोर टू बाय अ रेफ्रिजरेटर फॉर देर होम नशी नोटिस दैट हर मदर वॉज लुकिंग एट द कपेसिटी ऑफ द फ्रिज टू डिसाइड विच रेफ्रिजरेटर टू बाय द रेफ्रिजरेटर दे बॉट had the capacity of 500 liters now what is this capacity actually well the capacity of the refrigerator refers to the amount of space available inside the refrigerator now this can also be called as the volume of the refrigerator now what is this volume of the refrigerator well the volume of an object your refrigerator is the object so the volume is the measure of the space it occupies now this refrigerator it occupies some space in our homes so what space it will occupy in your homes will be known as its volume now the capacity of the object we were talking about is the volume of the substance its interior can accommodate so the space it will occupy externally will be called as volume and the things or the space available inside the refrigerator the amount of space that can that we can use inside the refrigerator it's called its capacity as you can see the capacity is the volume of the substance its interior can accommodate that means the refrigerator can accommodate inside it now how can we find out the volume of this refrigerator well the volume can be found out by length into breadth into height can you tell me why can we find out the volume as length into breadth into height well you can see that this refrigerator is a cuboid and you know what is a cuboid a cuboid is actually a rectangle with some thickness here you can see that this rectangle has a length has a breadth along with this height so this is a three dimensional form of the rectangle so the area of the rectangle is what length into breadth now to take out the volume of this cuboid which is actually a rectangle with some thickness or some height what we do is multiply the height with it to calculate this volume so the volume is actually this area of the rectangle into the height which makes it a cuboid so the volume of a cuboid is length into breadth into height So now you know how we got this formula as the volume length into breadth into height now the length and breadth and the height of the refrigerator is given to us let's find out the volume so the volume is length 0.4 into breadth 0.5 into height that is 2.5 Now zero point four into zero point five gives us zero point two into two point five, which gives us zero point five meter cube. Now remember that the volume always has the unit cubic meters or cubic centimeters. Why? Here you can see that we are multiplying three units here. So meter into meter into meter gives us what? One, two, three. That is why we use cubic meters. Now this is a cuboid. You can see we have the dimensions as twelve meter, five meter, and four meter. Can you find out the volume of this cuboid? Now we know. that the volume of a cuboid can be calculated with the formula length into breadth into height so simply we'll put the values here and find out the volume so it is what 12 into 5 into 4 this is 240 meter so volume of a cuboid is its length into breadth into height cubic units now i got the cpu from the market of whose volume i was known length was known to me breadth was known to me but height was not known 
So can you help me finding out the height of this CPU when I have the length, breadth and the volume? So I have a problem like this, where I know the volume of the CPU, I know the length, I know the breadth, but height is missing. So using the formula of the volume, can you find out the height here? Now we know that volume is length into breadth into height. So if I substitute each value below it, let's see what do I get. So volume is 36,000 is equal to length. Instead of length, we'll write 30 into, instead of breadth, I'll write 20. Now height is not known, so let's write it as height only. Now let us multiply. So 36,000 gives me 30 into 20, 600 into height of the CPU. Now to take out the height, I can shift this 600 to that side. Here it is multiplied, so taking it there, we'll divide it. So 36,000 divided by 600 will give me the height of my CPU. So height of the CPU is actually 60 centimeter. Well, not only the height, if any of these was missing and you have the other two values, you can find the missing value using the formula volume is equal to length into breadth into height.